Shenango Fork School District unveiled its new energy lab to inspire more students to get involved in STEM and renewable energy. Forks held a ribbon cutting for its new energy lab that was developed through a partnership with Broom Tioga Boses and New Energy New York. Through the partnership, Boses is offering new career and technical education courses dedicated to the energy sector. The lab and the program was created with input from Nobel Prize winner and co-inventor of the lithium-ion battery, Stan Whittingham. He says that far too often students study STEM, but when they graduate and look for a job, they don't have enough hands-on experience. We have to start not quite in the cradle, but certainly as the students get into middle school, get them interested in the STEM disciplines, get them excited about things. Not um, just sitting behind a talking head or reading a book. In my days, you could blow up things at the lab. <laughs> Bosi says the program is the first of its kind. The new two-year curriculum features topics like electronic theory, battery fundamentals, power converters, solar, and much more. The district superintendent of Bosi's, Rebecca Stone, says the goal is to prepare the students for the workforce. We're truly setting the stage for our students to become trailblazers for tomorrow. We're putting Broome County on the map as a powerhouse of battery manufacturing, research, and innovation. Where thousands of jobs will be created, fueling the innovation necessary to combat climate change and strengthen our nation's domestic manufacturing supply chain. During a brief tour of the lab, Fork students showed off some of their projects that range from circuit boards to programming a radio. The funding for the program was made possible by the EDA's Build Back Better Regional Challenge, in which BOCES was a grants recipient.